Well, I'd say I'm floating in the Great Salt Lake, but really I'm just sitting on the bottom. Day one of our Colorado and Utah adventure started out very early, leaving our house in Washington State at four o'clock in the morning. We're off on a grand adventure. Are you excited? Yes. <laughs> I can tell. Nice 12 hour drive today. 13 hour drive probably with stops. But this is our longest drive of the day of the trip I mean. So. It's 
literally starting tomorrow because today today seems like work. We're about two hours, probably not even two hours now, right? Yeah, less, less than two hours away from our hotel. It is five o'clock mountain time. We'll get dinner and a good night's sleep. I don't think either of us slept very well last night and not for very long. And then we'll call tomorrow the official start of vacation. Start doing fun stuff. Big lake over there to the right. Uh, oh. I don't see a lake. So we go like this, go. That's a big lake. It's not the salt lake though. I don't know what that is, it's pretty good size. Oh, maybe it is the salt lake. No, because we're going to Salt Lake. I know, but you kind of go around it. Oh. Oh, yeah, it is. That is Salt Lake. Yeah. Oh, that is. thing's huge. Yeah, it's a big, big lake. Mm -hmm. We're going to be going around it for a while, for two hours. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> oh, that is a big lake. Uh, huh. It's a pretty lake, um, in a weird way. It's like a, it's like a, a lake on an alien planet or something. We are driving into Antelope Island. Big long causeway. Show that too. Oh yeah, we should show this. We look like we're driving on the water. It's it's a tiny yeah. line there. But and but it looks like solid land, but it is not because some we saw there's tire tracks into the mud and it's very soft. Must be a construction like a cat or something. Here's the first bison we're seeing on Antelope oh, really Island. I can't, I don't oh, even know. Well, if... I'm going poo. Oh, that's kind of gross. Tails up, he's all squatted. Oh, that's great. Yeah, I got a picture of him anyway. I don't think I'm able to see him in the GoPro. So I'll take a picture of you taking pictures. <laughs> you we, can we can show the pictures later. Oh, but look at this amazing scenery. It's really hazy, there's it's hard like to see. Down there, isn't there? There's three. Here's our Jeep. Oh, we haven't looked at our Jeep yet. We haven't stood 10 feet away from our Jeep and admired it yet. Oh yeah, you gotta show them the clear plastic. The three oh, oh yeah, let's look at that. We have put protectant, we, and I say we loosely because it was all Mike, but we put the clear plastic protectant on the doors. Now we can run through the brush with the banded. So that is on all those sides and then I don't know. Did you put any on the front? No, it's all just on the back. Go like doors and back. Oh, and on the hood. Oh, I see. Oh, look at that. It's got bugs, bug splatter all over it. Gross. Mike just said, where are the antelope? Oh, right behind us. That is a close up. Usually they're not alone. What do you do not alone, Mr. Antelope? <laughs> just eating. Side view. Oh, he's there posing. Look at him posing for you. Oh, oh. he's going to lay down. Taking a nap. Oh, we're so excited to be off-road. Oh wait, this is still a road. This is a road, it's just not paved. They didn't say employees only, did it? No, it had a, like a real sign, so I'm sure it's fine. Oh, look at all that, that old buffalo. Oh my God. Oh my God, those are all bison out there. Look at that, the we whole hillside. The Mike's making fun of me because I start looking at things and forget to video them. But look at the cute little buffaloes. Ground down there, and the lake levels are pretty low. I guess the lake's only like 20 feet deep. Oh. It's super shallow, just super big, but super shallow the whole it way. It doesn't look like it's down that far. But if it's only a, yeah, that's true. I guess. I mean, yeah. I mean, it looks pretty flat. It doesn't look like huh. it's. It's not like way out. Way there. out there, right? Yeah. I think it's maybe been worse. I think it goes through like big cyclical changes. Wow, it's gorgeous. Here you can see the mountains over Salt Lake. They're all hiding in the haze. For scale, there's some mountain bikers down there, but you probably can't even see them in the GoPro. 
It's very green though on the edge of the lake. Very surreal looking. This little boulder field. And little trails everywhere through here. Nice. This rock. It's like rose quartz, sedimentary rock, like sheets of kind of granite quartz looking. I'm no geologist. There's a quartz in it. It's pretty cool. All right, let's go swimming. These are cool rocks. Yeah. Yeah, very nice looking. You happy? Yeah. Okay. Hey little guy, what are you doing? I see you under there. What? Lizard. All right, we went up that way. Came back that way. Nice trail. All right, off we go to the Great Salt Lake. See if we float. It's a little bit muddy right here, but we're still a ways from the water. This has been a long trek across the desert. There's even dead animals. Oh. We didn't bring any water. We may not survive, but we're going anyway. Oh, Ooh, there's seagulls. Oh, it's smelly. Oh. oh, okay, I'm gonna leave the towels back here where it's dry-ish. Is it dry right there? Okay. Does look like a tide line, even though I know it's not. All right, getting in the lake with the seagulls. It's kind of smelly. But it's not supposed to kill you. Yeah, it says it's safe. Oh God, look at all the. Oh my God. Look at all the shore flies. Apparently, they don't hurt you. They're just. Whoa. It's like a wave. Oh God, and that smell. Oh. You smell that? Yeah. Whoa, you can hear them moving. That's crazy, that's so many shoes on or off. One in with. I'm worried about losing my shoes. Well, that water is cold. Yeah? Like, you don't have mineral spring, you know? It's salty and oily. Yeah, and it feels kind of slimy. Kind of weird. You're a fish. I don't know, it is very foggy. It is kind of. Uh, crazy looking. It looks like we're walking into the void. Yeah. Kind of odd looking. All right, well. It's very flat. Very flat. As far as you can see. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. The salt ridge is over there. You can't see anything in the camera. It just looks like all the same thing it's and it all kind of goes together it just goes together it's just sky Ooh, and a good picture look at that all the you ripples get down low like this and take a picture oh that is squ oh that's ooky squishy bottom ah. oh i was kind of headed for these little rocks right here yeah oh god I'll lose a shoe I might lose a shoe in here oh god i don't think i can go forward <laughs> Well, I didn't fall down at least. Oh yeah, it's all these little pink red dots are brain shrimp, right? Well, you look at the cloud here, you know? That's where I walk, there's thousands of them. Oh. Ow. Oh, they're like a brownish. Oh, okay. They're actual shrimp. Actual little shrimps, yep. Oh, that's where they get those sea monkeys from that you buy. Well, that's what you use in aquariums. Oh, yeah. You get brine shrimp. I bought mm -hmm. them before for my fish, and they're just a whole big thousand of them now. It's all our food thread. Huh. Let me see if they come from here. Oh, very cool. You want to see them? Yeah, I see them. They're tiny. They're not the dots, they're the. 
They're the clear looking ones. Yeah, the clear ones. Yeah. Well, there's bugs on top too. I don't see any right here, but I can I see, see some over here. there. Yeah, I saw some yeah, in the cloud. Yeah, there, there are a lot. Yeah. Oh, but it's cold. <laughs> I can't like do the dramatic like I'm floating because I'm just sitting. My legs float right up though. <laughs> well, I'd say I'm floating in the Great Salt Lake, but really I'm just sitting on the bottom. It does feel very buoyant though. <laughs> well, now I can say I've been in the Great Salt Lake. As can you. You look cool. You look like you're just floating in space right there. <laughs> Get a salt bath. Get a salt bath. People pay good money for this at the spa. Well, I ventured out further into the lake, but I just kept getting stuck. My feet kept sinking further and further and further. I've given up. I had to sit down so I didn't sink and have to get rescued. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time, by the way. It's very salty. It's very buoyant. So it's pretty gross and dirty. Lots of goo floating in it. Okay, that is not us in the water, but that's what we just did. We just <laughs> doggy paddled and floated on our backs out about, I don't know, a couple hundred feet, hundred yards. Yeah. That took quite a ways. And it was still the same shallow muck. It was kind of gross and hot and I tried not to touch it. But the water felt nice. Say it. Water's about 75 degrees. Thank you. Very good for the weather report. Now we have to hike back to our car, which is up there through the hot desert. A little taste of the Utah scenery. We just left Provo and we're headed towards Moab. It's hard to see on film, but man, it is straight down and way down to the river down there. It's gorgeous, beautiful country. Looks like a painting. Mm -hmm. 